Greetings, everyone! It is I, Kikoskia, welcoming you to the stream. The pre-stream, to be exact, where you have the opportunity to get here, get comfortable, and get ready for the true day 187, not 37, oh my, that was a long time ago, of Hillsfar. Hello! How are you all today? And by all of you, I mean Burdent, Bunny Rabbit Hole, Crow! Uh, Desponia, Phoenix, Fixato, Hammy, HK Traden, uh, Joint Effort, Moochrome, and Turpentine. You forgot the announcements. Oh no! Hang on! Let me sort that. I got it. I got it. I don't got it. Hang on. There we go. I did it. I'm good at these announcement thingies. I am not good at these announcement thingies. Hello, Demon Dragon! There you are. Sorted it all! <laughs> Yay! Panic! No, don't panic! All calm. It's calm. Look. Yeah, Bella's not panicking. Yippee. And there's Moogle Chrome. Six months, six months in a row. Half a year of live, Kiko. Thank you so very much for your subscription. That is so kind of you. This is the stream where Business Peanut gives us Kitty's photo as two for one deal on Kyle's photo. I mean, that would be cool. But we know that's not going to happen. Hello, everyone. It's afternoon. It's afternoon here. I don't know what time it is for you, but it's afternoon here. Also, by the way, can we just stop to admire Rodeo's Halloween costume? What do you mean that's exactly like his normal costume? Yeah, that's exactly like his normal costume. Because it is his normal costume, but it's also his Halloween costume. Because that that's what he does. That is exactly what he does. So... Last time, which was two days ago, was Halloween. And if Rodeo gives me his photo today, I will be a sad. I will be a very sad. Also, what happened yesterday? Well, first off, we had Isabel telling us about mushrooms that were starting to appear on the island, because we're in mushroom season again. Mushroom pie. You miss Halloween festivities, but I hope everyone had a good time. It was good. It was good, thank you. Also, when in doubt, be sure to consult a fungal expert before eating any mushrooms you don't recognize. Indeed. It's definitely past eating where I am. Well, it's it's only going to be like, you know, a week or so before things get back to normal for the most part. And people, home due to illness, all the time in the world to watch this. Hey, good to have you. Although, get well soon. I'd rather you be well. But there we go. A fungal expert? A sentient fungus? No! An expert on fungus cav. There's Margie. Margie being cool. Margie sitting on a stump. Also, Bunny being cute, because Bunny's always cool. She's like, yay! Hey, it was, wasn't that a battle bond, Garrett? I suppose you could hire Toad, possibly. Guess who asked to leave yesterday? That's right. Rodeo asked to leave yesterday. And I'm like, you can't leave, Rodeo. I haven't got your photo. But how he said it was so cute. I don't want to say. It's real nice to hear that you want me to stick around on Hillsfar. That's how you feel. I'm going to stay here forever. Good luck getting rid of me now. <laughs> It was like, no, you can't go. And he went back to exercising. Oh, rodeo. Also, Kyle just interrupted him during a filming for his uh, his new song. He's working on it. He can't tell you exactly what it was, but he's working on it. And uh, yes, what to be up? What to be up? Indeed. Mayhem! Yippee! You have a surprise. Uh-oh. Doe is there with 18 months. Thank you so, so very much. That's so kind of you. Thank you. Also, Hammy just redeemed the Bavatar tax. The Bavatar is greatly appreciative of your generous donation of sesame seeds that he will use well. Meanwhile, the Avatar stares at you and goes, Really? You, you could have waited for, like, one more sesame seed? But, but you didn't? Speaking of thoughtful, Carl being thoughtful, Jitters being thoughtful. Jitters is thinking about crafting while being a ninja. Hey, uh, BNG Box, how goes it? 
I hope you're well. Welcome to the chat. I give a list of people wasting their sesame seeds instead of saving them up to thank me. <gasps> well, they do have to save them up for a couple thousand years, Cav. Like, that's, that's, that's a lot of... A lot of stuff. Oh. Thank you. It, it, it's just my voice. It's, it's just me. Also, here's pictures of Boris looking thoughtful. There's Boris. <laughs> and Boris also looking thoughtful. That That's a good thumbnail right there. That is a really good thumbnail. Like, I might use that as the thumbnail. And there he is also looking thoughtful. <gasps> Snort! Those are flowers. Boris is done with me. He's like, flowers. Oh, also, there are a couple of people in the museum as well. Like, Portia. She likes that dress. And dramatic pose. Oh, Portia. Indeed, yes. He was indeed. He I did indeed raid him. Hello, BNG Box. Welcome. Can't you lower the cost to thank a uh, cab by a few sesame seeds? No. It is a supreme quality thing. If we lower the cost, it will cheapen the ultimate reward. Also, we did have a Bella in the museum too. There's a Bella. Being an Eex. And there she is. Being the Eex, I am tiny. But museum is big. And we did end the day with Margie looking at all this. Because for some reason my education in nature villagers really like looking at seaweed. They really like looking at seaweed. Oh yeah, also, there was some sacks in my phone. So what is the plan for today? Well, we have the normal giving of gifts and stuff to do. Seaweed is fascinating. That's true. We also have to make sure that um, we hand over gifts to people. I just said that already. But uh, we need to make sure Kyle gets another amazing piece of clothing. Everyone else is pretty much on just um, fruit or clams. I may actually make today... A, a, a pearl day. Plan for today is, yep, cooing over adorableness. That's pretty much it. So if, if you're interested in that, be a uh, BNG box. We've got that in spades. Because that's what Hillsfar is all about. Villagers that are classed as lower tier and showing off how lovely they are and generally being overwhelmed by adorableness. Because that's Animal Crossing for us. I mean, eventually it'll be about the update. But it's gone 180 plus streams of just being adorable, so why not carry on this thing? You can call me Bing. Okay, Bing works fine. I will call you Bing then. It works. Now, I'm wondering which villager it's going to be that we're going to be focusing on today. Watch it rain, by the way. It'll rain on this island like it rained on Avataris. It'll rain. Or it might not rain. We might be lucky. Hey, no rain! Th there's also a Porsche. I've no idea what she's doing all the way out there. I think she might have been thinking about doing some yoga, but she's being adorable. You're currently booting villagers with amiibo cards before the update? Oh, fair enough. Just a couple of days till the update, that's true. We aren't having anyone leave probably in... Anytime soon, because only Bunny has handed over her photo. Yay, only rain on one island today. Yep. I remember last year, like Avataros, it rained like eight days in a row. I was not pleased about that. It was like, please stop raining. Please. And they were like, no. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Hills Far, it's 2 p.m. on Tuesday, November the 2nd, 2021. Hmm, there isn't any news to speak of today, but... Oh! The latest copy of my favorite magazine arrived today. I'm looking forward to reading it later. Um, oh dear. Well, I guess that doesn't really qualify as news, does it? That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. Yay, fun day! 
Alice's clock will be on time. Miyu comes home to watch Kiko stream and get some breakfast. Bush him. Oh, hello, G Vault. There's a business peanut. Hey! Business peanuts, leaving the intro. And 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 she really she really did just leave. Also, there are those socks. I should move those socks. So we know where Peanut is. Bank of Nook. Gave me some money. Peanut. Oh, she's telling me stuff. Sometimes you gotta take a break. Mom with a thing. I'm gonna keep that note. Luna there with a the thing. And lastly, we have Bunny. Fashion first, eh? Wow. We'll see about that. We will indeed. Right, let us, uh... Why does Kiko have Hammy's socks? I, I bought socks for Hammy to take. We never got round to the taking part. I see someone has redeemed maracas. Let me just sort through all the stuff that's here. Drop the socks on the ground. I have placed socks. They are now on the ground. They are a fixture. Mom gave us a reliable kitchen mat. And we got... A Dream Bell exchange ticket. Which we will put here. And... We got a hand knit pouch. And we have maracas. Hang on, that's not maracas. Do, do, do. We can't sit and brag us. If only we could sit and brag us. That'd be neat, but we can't do them both. I always like how you get so happy when you play an instrument, you're like, Yeah! 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 Now we can sit! Yeah. You see, I have sesame seed commands for the greatest things, like playing maracas! And sitting. No, no, playing an instrument takes no skill. Playing it well! Now there's the skill! Little did they know there was a quartet of villagers? Well, normally it's only three, so if it were four, I'd have to have one of the music villagers also doing a thing. Right, we need to... I did not mean to go up here. I did not mean to go up here. Brack is away. This down. That, that was foolish. I, I should not have... I should not have gone up there. Down we go. Right. Can't need to update your dream of But your socks, they can wait. Okay. There you go. That is the only specific item we are going to be giving a villager today. That piece of clothing. I think... Hmm. You know what? No. I think it's going to be a pearl day. I think everybody but Kyle gets pearls. Is this a mistake? Oh, absolutely. But am I still going ahead with it? Yep. This also frees up an inventory space, which is going to be pretty important. You know what happens when you give them pearls? Yeah. Oh, it, it did. It did. It, it's gone through retro. I saw a request for Bordis. Does this game have a multiplayer mode? I mean, y you can have people turn up and... You can also have multiple people on an island, but, uh... I tend to play single player. Occasionally people come round. Blathers is excited. Blathers isn't getting a pearl. Blathers is getting fossils to look at and then be told, Well, yes, we've already got them because we have a complete collection. I mean, I don't know why really I keep telling you this, but 
There you go. Complete collection and all that jazz. Just wrap all this up. And that. And we just need to change our attire and we're good to go. We're almost out of things to give villagers. We've actually almost reached that point where we have nothing to give. Oh, we need the beard. But I want to pick something else. Top 10 videos taken before disasters. Well, fair enough, Demon Dragon. You go do your thing. I'm going to wear... Okay, I have a plan. Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. Fitness tank? No, 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 I've got a plan. Okay, this is a good plan. Yeah. It may be autumn, but that doesn't mean it's not time to relax and chill in what sun there is left. Not long to coffee? Hey, I hope you enjoy your coffee. Better you than me. Also, those socks. Watch those socks be there for months now. They'll just be there on the floor for months. Never get picked up. Never have anything done with them. Just sort of there. Also, hi, pumpkins. Halloween's over. But no, for some reason, I always keep pumpkins growing. Oh, you meant jitters. Oh. Yeah, he's probably had some coffee by now. Hi, I'm here to audition for Background Gangster 3 and but No. No. This is Sandstar, looking stylish. Right, the sock statue is the focal point of the room. I mean, to be fair, it probably is the best part of the room. I, I have never been very good at, like, anything fashionable. So we're probably going to have to go immediately to the store and sell some things. There is no way to transmute those socks into real life exists. There is not, no. Those socks will forevermore remain on the floor. It on my island because oh no we don't have a oh well now we've definitely got to go to the store okay, there's a Margie we'll go check you out in a moment and give you oh rodeo oh <laughs> it's notes time as time passes we will put notes on those socks to remind us to pick them up that sounds about right <laughs> Hey guys, how you doing? I've got to sell you things. Mainly all this stuff, because I don't want it. I, I, I really don't want any of this. Take it all! 30,000 sounds like a bargain. Yeah, you'll have forgotten about the socks, and then you'll be reminded of the socks when we, like, burst into my house, and you'll see socks, and you'll be like, WAIT! THE SOCKS! I mean, I don't think it would be a good idea, Cape Sword. Because, uh, I don't want to see all the people trying to, uh, claim the Mona Lisa. It won't end well. Like, it won't end well. So let's go back to the beginning, start again. Go back to our house. You quote the socks! Oh no. Why do we want to quote about socks? They're just socks, everyone. There we go. There we go. We have all the money. And maybe Bella will, maybe Bella will finally, uh... Yep, don't forget to water that last set of pumpkins. Good, good reminder there. I'd almost forgotten. <laughs> Need to make sure those pumpkins grow evenly so I can get annoyed by them growing again. 
That, that's how that goes, right? Right? They're not watering the socks. You don't water socks. That's not how that goes. Did I water these? Hmm. I feel like... I must... I don't know. Anyway. We've hit that. I've got maracas in my hand for some reason. Getting distracted. Hello, Margie. Where are you going? Greetings. How are you, Tootie? I'm gonna give you a gift. You wanna give me something? That I do. Would you like this lovely and amazing pearl? Can I go ahead and open this? Of course you can. Wow, you're really giving me a pearl? Yep. Thanks a lot. It might come in handy for something I've been planning. Here, I want you to have my tape deck. You can now have sick tunes, Tootie. Thanks, Margie. What do you mind, Tootie? I just wanna chat. Have you ever been inside Bella's home? Doesn't her decorating style seem so... Bella? Like, you'd know who lived there even if you had, they hadn't invited you in. I feel like there's gonna be music in my future. I feel like there's gonna be music. <gasps> Yay! Oh, music! Da! Oh, here we go! Adorableness! Oh, she's about to change songs. Yeah. Team title: Socks, adorable music, but I don't know. I haven't thought that far ahead, Hammy. Look at how happy she is. Do. Look how happy. I tried to get a picture of her going, Meh, and then she's like, nope. Song's done now. Oh, Tootie. She was just done there. She's like, nope. Well, time for us to carry on. Well, there's Kyle. We do have a new piece of clothing to give Kyle. We're running out of pieces of clothing to give people. We know Peanut's not him. Business Peanut's out on a business trip. We just don't know where that business trip exactly is, but, uh, there's... Th that was... That was a smaller rock, Kiko. You can't get more rocks from the smaller rock. You have to actually hit the big rock. Oh, well. Got something for you, buddy. Hey, uh, always great running into you, Sandstar. I've got a gift for you. Oh, for real? Oh, yeah. You are gonna like this a lot. Now, what do we have here? Oh. My. Gosh. Is this really a tuxedo jacket? This is the kind of gift I've got to try him right away. Oh, look how amazing he is! Oh yeah, the color's exquisite. Oh, he looks so good! You know, I can't just accept this without giving you something in return. Let's see. How would you feel about a Gizzard Chad Sushi costume? I mean, I'm gonna sell it, but thank you very much. Yo, you want a chat? I don't blame you, Alpha. You know how some folks pretend they don't like to gossip. Ha! I'm up front. I love gossip. So, I heard this from someone on Hills Far. Word on the street is you've got crazy skills when it comes to adventuring. Is that true, Alpha? That's right! Yeah, I can't see a future for myself in adventuring. Now there's a reference. I'm gonna stick to what I know best. Personal branding. Peanut! Oh, Sandy! Hi there, my fabulous bestie! Got a gift for you. You, what is it? I'm just gonna sit right here while you give her a gift. Oh, what is it? What is it? What is it? I'm gonna purple now. Okay, let me see. Ah! A, a pearl! Thanks! Give me stuff I can put to good use. That's super fab, Sandy! I feel kind of bad the only one getting stuff. Here, take a poolside bed! You thought it'd be my photo, but it's not! It's a free samples. 
What is it, Snacker? I got a gift for you. Conversation. Okay, so lately, I've been craving yakisoba no -so non-stop. But if I had to choose between that and hoshata, I pick hoshata every time. No joke, it makes an awesome chip dip. It's the dark horse of every potluck spread. I said to what I know best, personal branding. Mrs. Pino was by with a smile that says, that's adorable. Yup. Oh, 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 he's getting distracted. <laughs> I need a good picture of you, wait. I need a good picture of you wearing that vibrant, that lovely tuxedo there. Am I going to get one here? Possibly. No, I'm just going to get him staring longingly at a tree. That'll do. He always just looks half there, thinking about something else, a world away. He's coming up with his next amazing hit song, that's what he's doing. Amazing hit song, on the loose. So we're giving a gift to Peanut, we're giving a gift to Margie, and we're giving a gift to Kyle. Still many more people, and there's Grizzly. Giving me some modeling clay. Good sir, I already know how to make that, but I do greatly appreciate it. Oh, there's Rodeo! And there's you having a thought there. Canberra. Oh, just the buddy I wanted to see! There was a two for one sprite costume deal. But who really needs two? So I'm giving you the extra. Think of it as payback for all the times you dumb me a solid. Well, thanks, Canberra. You don't have to keep it if you don't want it now. Nah. But if you decide to re-gift it, I don't want to know. Yeah, what's up, now? Nah? I got a gift for you. Seriously? You rock. What do you got? I've got this for you. Have the thing. You don't mind if I open this now, right? A pearl? Very cool. Thank you, Senstar. I'm... I need to think about how I'm going to use this. I see Boris. Surprise gift exchange. Here, take some monochromatic dot flooring. Well, thanks, Canberra. No problem. You get nah? Did you forget to name last time? Nope, just want to chat. I saw Sahara hanging out a little while ago. She's got some sweet new rugs for sale, nah. I don't know if it's a sales pitch or all that rad rug patterns, but I spend way too much when she's around. Now, if you don't mind, I'm going to go do some fishing. Even though I don't actually, you know, have a place here I can fish. Oh! Rodeo's there, just no! Oh. I gotta get a picture of. Oh, oh, he's getting up! Oh, they're having a conversation! What? Since when do you care about being popular? Ah! Since I found out being popular gets you free food. If I were popular, I could be eating tomato salad, key lime pie, and polenta all day. Being popular is an all-you-can-eat lifestyle. Hold up. Where would you hear that being popular gets you dinner? Aha. Uh -huh. You could be popular too, Canberra. I got a plan to make meals flow, flow like gravy chaps. Slow up. I never said I wanted to be popular. First, we make a list of all the food we want everyone to give us. Like, you have a potato salad? It's so good. Oh, but I also want some cotton candy, too. Hey, Rodeo, you still with me? I said I didn't want to be popular. I wonder how you can get potato salad with chunks of cotton candy mixed in. Oh, I know. I'll get the cotton candy, and then you get the potato salad, and then you give it to me. Anyway, that's my plan. What do you think? Yeah, it sounds like you thought about this as hard as you could, Rodeo. Oh, Rodeo. Yay, Sandstar! I was just thinking about how I wanted to see you. I got a gift for you, buddy. Ha! Huh. Do I get something? You do! Yeah, it's not a good plan. I would... Zero out of ten, Rodeo. Not enough white chocolate. I wonder what's inside. I'm gonna open it. Ooh, a pearl! Thanks. Chaps. I wonder what kind of stuff I can make with this. Here, man. It's a ninja costume. Enjoy, chaps. I had ninjas get the best food. I want to be a ninja one day. What's up, chaps? I just want to chat. Did you happen to know it was a really good smell the other day? Because I sure did. Want well, to know what it was? It was peanut shampoo. It smelled so good. Like, like cherries and lime sherbet. Amazing. Science made a shampoo that smells like lime sherbet. Where you go, science? Oh. I'm not sure that was its intention, but sure. Now, if you don't mind, 
I'm gonna sit here, you're gonna shoot down that, um, uh, that, that balloony thing, and then you're gonna get a picture of me being cute. And it's like, yes, you're right, I am gonna get a picture of you being cute, and then we're gonna go talk to Boris. Oh, look at him, he's just like, yeah, this is a good place to sit. He's got the beach, and he's got flowers, and bugs. Okay. I like this place. Hello. I'm really, really, really growing attached to Rodeo. Like, I'm really growing attached to Rodeo. Also, there's some clay. It can go with my other clay. And we can go find Boris quickly. Was there something here? Nope. Where did Boris go? Uh, Boris! Boris, why you thought bubbling now? Boris? For some reason, I keep saying snort over and over. I don't know how it happened. Can't even remember the first time I said it. Anyhow, all that matters is whether or not I should keep on saying it. What do you think? I think it's fine. Seriously? You sure about that? Well, that's good to hear. I suppose I kind of got in my own head in that one. Snort! Ah, it feels good to say it without shame. Oh, look how happy he is. Look how happy it is. Sum it up. I just want to give you a gift. Um, you, you have something to give me? I do. And somebody wants me to talk to you, so talk to you we shall, buddy. Hey, what, what, I what it is, I'm, I'm excited to open it. Oh, uh -huh. a, a pearl? Yep. In case you never know what will come in handy until you need it, right? Well, glad to take it off your hands. I don't want any freebies. Here, man, have a cassette player. You can listen to sick tunes. Oh, wait, wait, Margie gave you one too? Oh, well, now you got two. How's it going, Snort? The march of technology sure is something, ain't it? Have you seen the TVs they have now? They're half as thin as a piece of paper. And the picture? Wow! The images are so lifelike that it's like you'll reach in and become part of what you're watching. Don't actually reach in, though. For all their bells and whistles, new TVs scratch just as easy as the old ones. Oh, Boris. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go catch me some bugs. Maybe. You seen any bugs around? If, if you do, could you... Could you tell them... I want to catch him. Uh, tell him not to move so fast, like I'm not, I'm not as fast as I used to be. Don't tell the bugs that. Now, we haven't found- Boris is actually hunting for wild zen cushions. I better not tell him I have a stack of them at home. Oh, 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 who have we found? He's here! Afternoon, Berserk. You doing good? I totally am. This is for you. Witty, what is it? It's Jitters! And we got him a pearl. What's inside? Oh, neat, you seriously got me a pearl. I did. Well, this is great. It'll be perfect for some heavy curls, Berserk. You know, every time you say that, Jitters, I have no idea how that works. Time to flex my gratitude muscles. I want you to have some mariachi clothing. Now you can dance and be swole. Um, what's going on, Berserk? I'm just chatting with you. Do you think I'm too focused on fitness? Because Kyle said I need a new hobby. I guess I've always wanted to see how fast I am compared to all other creatures. I could catch bugs! Although, some bugs are slow, aren't they? Maybe this will teach me patience and humility. Or maybe I'll absolutely shred my quads from crouching in anticipation. Either way, it's a win-win! Oh, Jitters. Jitters just stacks all the presents we give him in boxes and lifts it. You know what? Honestly, I could see him doing that. I could absolutely see him doing that. Also, that is a really... Oh, there's some maracas. Somebody wants maracas. Do not worry. We shall help Peanut do her business trips by using maracas. Let's uh, just get the maracas. Hey, Peanut. <gasps> you scared away the bug. Oh, oh no! Oh no, she's gonna sit on- Oh no, it's cute! It's cute! Hang on, I gotta take pictures of cute first! Cute! Then! Hello! I got some maracas for you to listen to! Poor Sandy! We're seeing a lot of each other today! I didn't actually mean to talk to you, but sure! Oh, so like stuff like this wild bench. Kind of weird, right? 
Somebody said that tree's the wrong shape, so they cut it down and made it this shape. I mean, that is a bit strange. Also, I'm following you, following you, and playing maracas, playing... What's up? Try to put some pop stars together, and I'll just keep accidentally talking to you. What do you think about taking a picture in front of something like a tiki torch? Would that kind of background highlight my best features or overshadow me? Oh, don't answer. I'll just take a hundred selfies and find out for myself, slacker. I'm gonna go to the airport. Gotta check on my emails. Oh, peanut. Now we need to. Oh. Oh, he's like. Yeah, fire! What do you mean? Okay, we found a, uh, another fossil, by the way. In a few days' time, we're going to be finding more than fossils. Does the airport even have a place to check your emails? Don't tell Peanut there isn't one. Why are you apologizing? Also, guess who's in here? That's Porsche! And... She's crafting. Also, umbrella, hat, taking up both slots, glasses. I mean, at least these things have been moved over to there, but still, this is sad times. Raffian, what is it? You're watching me so intently, it's a bit unnerving. What are you doing? Now, you see, I'm working on a cosmos shower. It's a DIY crafting project, my dear. I was daydreaming, you see, and the design came to me. And just like that, I made it happen. Oh, you already know how to make a cosmos shower, don't you? I do indeed. Of course, I should have known. I expect no less of you, Sandstar. Well, I've made a recipe card. I do want more folks to try making the cosmos shower. If you know anyone interested in DIY projects, it would be lovely if you shared it with them. Soon, Portia, soon. Mark my words, Ruffian, if this recipe catches on, everyone who's anyone's going to want a Cosmo shower. Do you need me for something, Ruffian? I wanna give you a gift. Oh, you shouldn't have. No, I insist. Also, any person I haven't given a gift to yet is... Hmm. Well, 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 what could it be? Who is it? Well, look at that. It's a pearl. Thank you, Sunstar. You're too kind, Ruffian. How can I thank you? Ah, what do you take as reward of a flashy hairpin? Oh, thank you, Porsche. We... I only have two more gifts left to give. Two more gifts! And... One of them's Bella. I'm trying to think about who the other one is. Bella and... Rodeo? No, I've given Rodeo something. Ah, idea. Who's the other person? Oh, the, the, the glasses look amazing on her, but she's never going to wear them. Hello, uh, Tony Cortex. How goes it? I'm just trying to think about who the other person I need to give a gift to is. Because we have Boris, Bella, Bunny, Canberra... Kyle, Peanut, Margie, Porsche, Rodeo. We give them one to Margie, Canberra, Jitters, Kyle, Peanut. Who haven't I given a gift to? Like, really? Check the map? I mean, I could check the map, but that's not going to tell me who I haven't given a gift to. Was it you? Hey, I feel like I'm seeing you a lot today. Am I seeing you a lot, or did I just feel that way? No, I've given you one. Just holding a fishing rod makes me feel like I'm an expert fisherman. I'm going to fool so many fish! Oh yeah, Bunny! We haven't given a gift to Bunny, which is ironic, because we already have Bunny's photo. So it's Bunny and Bella. I mean, there's still a chance that we could end up with a photo. We just have to get somebody... Well, I gave up on that whole catching bugs thing and said, I'm going to look at this flower. There we go. Ah. 
Wait, are we waiting for Bunny to Thought Bubble? I mean, Bunny could Thought Bubble. Hello, Timo. How goes it? I hope you're well. The other Peppy and the other other Peppy. That's true. We do have a lot of Peppies. A Zen Flower. Well, if I take care of it, it may eventually go into a Zen Cushion. I mean, that's how that works, right? It's like, no. Also, I'm going to keep the Coral. Someone told me that uh, Coral is a good thing to give people to uh, get photos. So I'm going to keep the Coral. Might start doing that on Avataras as well. Also, thank you. Now, we need to find Bunny and we need to find Bella. We don't know where Bella is. And Bunny's probably at home. Now, let's go over here and see if we can find them. Anyone here? The answer is... Ooh, well, there is a mushroom. Mushrooms are neat. Mushroom, uh, pumpkins are a pretty good option, that's true. But I tend to sell them. Because I don't do uh, turnips, I tend to sell them as a ready supply of uh, money. Like, don't do turnips on Hills Far, so they're like a pseudo thingy. They get the job done. Also, also I'm using a pink shovel. Goes well with the uh, ensemble. There we go. Okay, grab all of this. Nothing here. Is Bunny in? We're about to find out. The answer is no! Bunny is not in. Are you in here though? I really hope you are. Because I am really looking for it. There you all. Oh. Hey there. Welcome to this movie. So fashion me. Lovely by claw. Thank you. Oh, she looks so cute today. Hi, Zenstar. What a quinky dink running into you here. Hello. Ah, look at you. I'm so into your style. I could pop. We have to wear matching outfits sometime. Daiji Tokyo. What's up? 200 princess being pop stars together. I want to give you a gift. You give me a thing. That I am. Would you like a pearl? Ooh, what is it? It's a mystery! I'm gonna open it now! What? It's a pearl! Thanks! Give me some makeup to good use! That's super fab, Sandstar! Hey, I wanted to say thanks for like an object! It's a top hat! Enjoy! And now we can be fash! The most fash! Stands for fashionable, because that's what we are! You know the tapestry hanging on the left wall over there? It belonged to our mother. Every time I look at it, I get this warm feeling inside. Like when she would hug me. Mm. Also... It does not go. It is not the right colour. If it was the right colour, I would wear the top hat. But it is not. I know. She just gave me a random top hat. And there's Bunny just being like, I'm looking at this fashion that never changes on the walls. Do you need the freedom room? Go right ahead. Thank you. The only person we need to find now is Bella. <sighs> Anything good here? No. Flashy kimonos. I mean, that's really cool. But also, no, because I think I already have that. I mean, I could, but also, no. <laughs> Flashy kimonos, yeah. Look at those flashy kimonos. We're good for now. I'm pretty sure I have all the flashy kimonos. Those are the ones you've been thinking of and you've been looking for them forever? Well, they're all here. Oh, 
I don't have flashy kimonos. Huh. I actually don't have them myself. Well, I might be making some purchases. I have all of them, I just don't have the kimonos. Well, I'll be popping back here in a little bit with uh, some... Uh, nah, I'll just do it now. I was thinking of going to get my, like, tailor tickets. But there are six of these, and I'm just going to start buying them. Besides, they wouldn't even cover it, they're 4,800. <laughs> There we go. Just uh, buy all these. I'm very worried I'm going to run out of space in my storage when I do this. Because I really don't have much space in my storage. Also, I see Bunny being adorable there, so I'm just going to get a picture of Bunny in a moment. It's a good way to spend my money, if nothing else. Bunny! Hello. Your pink coat. <laughs> well, coincidence. I'm buying them as well. Bunny's like, is he buying those kimonos for me? Answer, no. Just hold on, Kiko. Not long now, I know! Like a few days, and then I can like royally start expanding my storage. Just a few days. Fortunately, they're still going into my home. So I still have a tiny bit of room, clearly. I still have enough room. There we go. That's like 22, 23 grand spent on them. Thanks. Please come again. No problem. There we go. I've got those in my catalog for order. I imagine that when you order them through the Nook Shopping, they're just an order is sent to the Able Sisters and they send it on to Tom. It would probably still look pretty good, Retro. Well, when you get one, you can always go to Harv's Island and have a look. That's the that's the good thing about Harv's Island. You can just have a look. And see how things appear. And if you don't think it looks neat, you don't give it to them. Now, gotta go up this area. There's one more... Did I hit the rock that was here? I always forget whether I've hit this rock. Have I hit this rock? Yes. Worth one extra hit. Didn't want to miss all those resources. You did? Yeah, a little late, but uh, good to know still. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There is a stick. And a mushroom. Mushroom right there. It, it. Rock. Glad to have that rock emote I am. Now we make our way down here. Grab more sticks. Would it be right if you came for the kimonos? I mean... After the stream, you can just take them. I'm not gonna use them. I'm not gonna use the socks either. I can just put them outside. You can just, like, grab them at some point this evening. I can always just order more. Right. Grab this. Now, we're going to have to go to the museum, I think, because we still haven't found Bella. We still haven't found all of the uh, mushrooms. We found four. I don't know if you find five or six mushrooms. I mean, you 
should just have them all anyway. Like, uh, I'm probably not going to use any of them. Although I might see how Margie looks in the pink kimono. Take my kimonos, players. I mean, I don't need them. Literally don't need them. Right, nothing hit. Oop, there was a uh, orchid mantis. Now, Bella could be up here. Bella is totally not up here. Nope, Bella is not. There's so many gold flowers here. All these gold flowers because we haven't found... We haven't got any more photos. And unless we get a treasure hunt, there's not going to be a uh, another one now. Let's go and... Yeah, fire! Oh, you. Let's go find Bella. She is somewhere in here. It's just a question of where. Ooh. Oh dear, pardon me. Why, hello, Sandstar. Welcome to the Hills Farm Museum. How may be of service? I want you to assess some fossils. Ooh, would you like me to assess? I'm all a flutter. I want you to assess all of these, please. Ooh, more than one, I see. Let us take a closer look, shall we? Yes, indeed. They're quite splendid. Alas, our museum already has fossils such as these. I haven't intended to purchase these in my personal collection, but no, I must exercise restraint. I will tell them to you now. How may I be of service? I want nothing else, please. Jolly good. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. I don't know where Bella went, but uh, she might be in here. Have fun. I'm gonna go find her. Is an eek in here? No. It's literally a mouse hunt. Yep. Yeah, we are looking for a mouse so that we may give her a pearl. Because she is worth the pearl and so much more. Well, that's a sign, Hammy. Time to give it to Whitney. Oh, there she is! Hi, Sandy! What a quinky dick running into you here! What's the latest? It just looks like a hunk of rock, but it was deaf doing the alive thing a long time ago. Hello, Bella. Hmm. What is it, Ix? I want to give you a gift. For me? Mm. Yes, you can have a gift if you go have a pearl. Why could it be? I'm going to sing while I open it. Ooh, a pearl. Yep. Thanks. Give me stuff I can put to good use. That's super fab, Sandy. Here, I'll trade you. It's a floor lightning. You love those. No photo for you. Not today. Hi there. What do you need? I just want to chat. I bet they never imagined that 300 gazillion years after their last coffee they'd be getting stared at by us. I don't want to wait for that long to have my folks see me. Put me on stage right now. Oh, look at the, look at the Bella. Hi, Eeks. Oh. Oh. No. Oh. Are you going to go look at Eeks? I love to get food and thought you were talking to Peanut again, but it was Bella and my mom was business, Bella. She's wearing a little ribbon. Yep. She's wearing a little ribbon. Look, I'm going to stare at this fish. Oh, they have very interesting dialogue, the peppies, when you look at the corporate. Ew, grody. No, groblergy. They are not impressed by the corporate. Yo. Yo. Oh. Nil X. Looking at the fossils. I don't, I don't want to look at these. I, I want X to talk. Even though they just look like fish, you still, uh, use then up turn are like the peak of evolution. The evolutionistas. Wait, you brought these fossils, Sandy? Oh my gosh, they're so cool! I, I, I don't want to look at these! 
Game! Who knew dead stuff was so cool? Uh, <laughs> Anna Maracolis has the biggest, cutest, most adorable eyes! Their mouths are less cute though. Wait, you bought this muscle too, Sandy? Oh my gosh, that's so cool! And it's very cool. And I'm cute enough to get away with anything, Eeks! Oh, Just talk out! And now we have done all that, we should sell these fossils and see about making a little bit of room in our storage because we're probably very full on that. Meow. All right. Just gonna sell some thingamies. Floor light, this, that, this, that, hat, that, and these as well. I don't know how many mushrooms we have. I really don't want to hold on to too many mushrooms. We really don't want to hold on to too many. But we'll find out how much storage space I have in a minute. Is that a car over there? No, it's just his record player. I don't know about you, but I cannot wait to have a lighthouse that isn't yet. Hey, I like my lighthouse the color it is. It's a cool lighthouse. Now let's pop into here and lament that I have no storage space. Let's deposit all of this. And I got mushroom here. Hey, socks! I know. We might move the socks soon. Oh, we are literally full. So, we are literally full on space. We don't want that. We don't want that. We don't want this. We don't want that. We don't want this, all that, all this. Um, may I have two rare mushrooms? No, well, we can work something out later. Um, what else can I make room by getting rid of? Don't tell Boris. Seriously, don't tell him. He'll get so... Ooh. I can get rid of that too. Uh, anything else? Anything else that's mundane? I feel like I'm going to need that at some point, so I'm not going to get rid of that, and I'm definitely not getting rid of that. Oh, my inventory is so just full of stuff that I want to keep. I want to keep all of it. Wait, is that wild half painting? I don't know. I think it's fake because it's like a darker color for the person. Yeah, I thought it was. Do I need two spooky floorings? No. Do I need two spooky walls? No. Do I need four spooky rugs? No. I really don't need any, like, that many of any of those. I also don't need that many spooky table settings. Or spooky candles, or uh, candy sets. Like, I don't need all of them. That's possibly saved me a little bit of room. Okay, feeling a bit better now. Feeling a bit better now. We have storage space. Took a bit of work, but we have storage space. Also, unless it's a rare uh, mushroom, I should pretty much just sell all the mushrooms I come across, because I don't need them either. 
sell some dresses. Uh, fun fact, I don't actually have that many dresses to sell. Like, my storage is pretty much um, clothing I either want or clothing I want to save. I've made, like, 16 spaces. That is more than enough. I mean, all of this is being sold. It's going to give me a fair amount of coin. They even get me over 100,000. Yep, well over 100,000. Marvelous. We can put all this in with the, uh, with the rest of the money. Also, we can clear a thing. There we go. What's the max currently? 2,400. Now tell Boris about what you just did. No, no, no. Boris must never know. Business peanuts walking into a wall. Also get a nice picture of this peanut there. And now we will go and uh, do something very important. Well, first off, nothing in here. They're doing a bit of spring cleaning before they have a lot more stuff to do. And I mean a lot more stuff. Right. ABD. Okay, I need to deposit uh, 96,576. There we go. Oh yeah, we're getting double our storage space again. The last major one got us from 1,600 to 2,400, which was 50%. Now it's going over 100%. So think of all the storage space I have right now, double it, and give my and uh, then think of an extra 200. Yeah, so many clothes. It's going to be full of so many clothes. I don't know about you folks. I think it's time to say hi to Delhi again. I think it's time to... Have the, the lazy monkey come in and say hi. I'm Jelly. What do you need? I'm your bard, so let's get real interesting. Oh, camping? You betcha. I love your island, Munch. Okay, he is super adorable. I really, really like Dally. Look at how cute he is. Such a big, wide smile. Also, they're no longer cleaning. Like, Dally is adorable. And if Alias were here... Oh, Boris, about the Zen cushions. Oh, you want me to talk to Boris, g -Vol? Don't worry, I will men I will talk. Boris is still here. Right, I will talk to Boris. Always oh, a pleasure to see you. Well, want to chat? You're in the unsolicited advice, right? Because I got a doozy for you. Did you know? You can keep your clothes from fading and fraying if you wash them inside out. Just don't forget to turn your clothes back the right way before you put them on, kiddo. And if you happen to spot me wearing inside out clothes, be a pal and pretend you didn't know it, okay? Oh, anywho, just felt like sharing a nugget of wisdom with you. Take care now, Snort. Hey, what can I do for you? I want to chat. Question for you, kiddo. You got a sweet tooth? Me, I don't like sweet things. Except apple cider vinegar. <laughs> anyway, the other day I spilled some cinnamon sugar on my regular dry toast. I was so mad. But then I gave it a try, wouldn't you know? Tasted better than usual, Snort. I guess that's my way of saying, try new things, kiddo. It helps keep you young. See how well it's working for me? <laughs> He is a big of wisdom. Oh, hey, kiddo, what's on your mind? Well, now, your outfit's really interesting, Sandy. I ain't no fashion expert, but I got something here that might just look good with that kid up of yours. Some loafers. Kind of fits the style with the other stuff you got on, I think. Oh, how bad's it gonna be? Just want you to look your best. All right, buddy, what you give me? I mean... They do work? I mean, they're black. They do work. Not bad. That's a 6 out of 10. But I prefer my label or uh, label sneakers. I mean, their style. I think that's how you say it. It's probably not how you say it. Over here we go. Round up, round up, and here. And before you know it, 
We have arrived. Oh, he's got his sandwich. I'm here to hang out. Thanks for the invite, Munch. Oh. Man, isn't this tank great? It's a real easy one. You can pull out your pocket and pop right up. The hard part's when I gotta go home. And it's really hard to fold up. I don't think I can do it alone, Munch. Oh, you'll find a way. Man, I'm really one this evening made this island like a wooden simple bed. Mm, I could do that. Yeah, you do that for me? Yeah, and I'm glad my brain told me that idea. I can't wait to see it. But I gotta see it today though, because I'm going home tomorrow. So a wooden simple bed. Be honest with me, Daddy. Are you making me build this just because you don't like the sleeping bag? Haha, <laughs> yeah, sleeping bag's rubbish. I want an actual bed. In your camp, tent. Yeah. Okay. Wooden simple bed. That is 18 normal wood. You, you're real fortunate that I think you're amazing. But then again, I think everyone's amazing. His catch-up makes me think he ends his sentence like take a bite out of his eyes. I mean, I could see it. Every time he finishes, he just gets out of sandwiches. And just eats the whole thing. And then he pulls out another sandwich. So, 18 bits of... Oh... Peanut has changed. She is no longer Business Peanut. Business Peanut's taking a break. She's wearing a default outfit. That's the one she started with. The one I completely diverted away from. Because I went, no, you are Business Peanut. And then she became Business Peanut. Yep, Sasha's a lazy. And I think that's pretty cool. Right. Fortunately, I have plenty of wood, so uh, we can uh, save on an inventory space. Well, too bad, Hammy. There, there. I... Maybe? I mean... I look at all the villagers and go... Hey, you're adorable, therefore you must be high tier. And then I look at them and they're like, oh, you're tier, like, five. I imagine they will be popular initially merely because they're new. Who knows if that will remain the case. Also... Yeah, it, 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 it floats regardless of what time of day it is. You don't fool me. You don't fool me, statue. I mean, remember, Megan wasn't popular. Megan wasn't popular, and neither's Sid. Hey, Deli, I got you your thing. Hello. You look real happy. Did you make that thing we talked about? This way come back later, the socks are gone. That would be unusual. But I don't think that'll happen. Yay! I got an original thing made on my trip to Hills Far. Will you take this as thanks? It's a pinball machine, and it's only kinda sticky. What? Thanks and a real neat souvenir. Man, this island's so great. I hope you invite me back. I want to visit over and over again. The wooden simple bed you made me real nice. Real nice. Thanks, Munch. He's always my favorite place that doesn't got a menu to color while you wait for pie. That's... I, I love that line from all the lazies because it's so oddly specific. Like, if we had a menu to color while he waited for pie, this could very well be the greatest place. Who brings a pinball machine while camping? The same person that wanted me to make him a bed. I mean, he just wants to play pinball. Well, why don't you live here? That's a new idea. You ought to invite me back someday so I got time to think about it, okay? I was look at that expression. Once again, I like the chair because I don't think about what I was doing. Now I think stuff through. Don't be elected sheriff randomly. Oh, he's not a good sheriff. 
Meet a pie shop? Too bad. No pie shop for you. Not that kind of game. Ooh, a pouch of gold. And there's Cape Sword. Thank you so very much for the 100 bits. That's so kind of you. Thank you. That really is kind. Also, there's a good picture. No. He's really nice. I really like him and his little tail. Bop, bop, bop. He doesn't quite bob like the uh, squirrel tails, but nothing bobs like the squirrel tails. Gonna quickly sneak away. And he goes, bye. The little smile in the wave. I need to actually put some thought into where things are gonna go on the island. Like, I need to put some thought into, like, where I'll put everything when the update happens. Like, I need a farming patch somewhere. I don't know where that's going. Like, I don't know at all where that's going. No clue. Just, just numb. Like, I could extend this out, but really there's not going to be a lot of space if I do that. I should probably, like, change an area over. Well, there isn't enough places in the third level for one. Maybe somewhere on the second level I could put it? Hmm, that's, uh, bubbles aren't fast enough there. They are not fast enough at all. I can think about that once I've got the scallop. Once I've got the scallop, that, that is a plan of action, as it were. Margie! Margie, I see you thought bubbling there. What's wrong? What are you doing? She's thinking. I remember the first time I saw this when I was playing on Avataris. I panicked. I'm like, what, what's happening? Ah, Sandy, now that you're here, maybe you can help me out with a problem. I got carried away, buying a raincoat. I wasn't sure what to do with my surplus, so I thought I'd give to you what I don't need. Oh, thank you, Margie. Feel free to do whatever you want with your gift, Tootie. I will sell it. And you will just start doing yoga. Right there. Yeah, yep, perfect place to do some yoga. Even the villagers are having storage problems. I have never hit my villagers intentionally. I may have accidentally once or twice hit them acci like accidentally and they've never re like, like remarked about it, but I would never hit them intentionally. Like I don't want to do that. That's mean. Besides, it's pretty easy on uh, Avataras because I don't want anyone to leave, so it doesn't matter if someone thought bubbles to leave. Because I'll just say no. Here! Now, if Bunny asked to leave, that'd be neat, but uh, really what I need is more people to hand me their photos. What I need is for somebody to want to do a treasure hunt or something, but uh, I haven't had many treasure hunts recently. In fact, I haven't really had many photos recently. I've just been really unlucky with photos. Like, really, really unlucky. Ah, uh, well, they do exist, the uh, pitfall seeds, but I've never actually used one on anyone but myself. I used one on myself so that I could uh, get the achievement for it. Also, this could be... My niece is trying to get the mighty stinky. Well, I wish them luck. That is, that's a crab. A Dunganess crab. Really, I should be holding onto something like that, because at some point we're going to be getting the, um, the, uh, turkey day. And I'm going to need a Dunganess crab. But I don't have the storage space to hold onto a Dunganess crab. Hopefully, I'll be able to get one before the um, turkey day itself. 
also you can just trade with people for uh, stuff. Okay, th 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 this is not going to be what I'm looking for. Oh yeah, this is a Venus flower basket. Not what I'm looking for. Hi, floating present. Bye, floating present. I really don't want the floating present. Like, it's not going to have very much in it that I actually want. Also, this could very well be something I do want. There we go. Yeah, they don't appear now, naturally. Um... The um, pitfall seeds only appear if you or somebody else digs one there. They're not natural now. They don't spawn out and about. I think Kiko spends the next hour. I could spend the next hour trying to find a scallop. This could happen. Or it could appear right now. Thanks, timing. That was a thing. That was, that was some great timing. Hey, man, about that scallop of yours. Can I have it? Sure you can. Oh, thanks for generosity, man. That floating present had business speed at photo, Raiko, and 20k, so I know. Ginger were cool, I'll actually something you'll dig. While I'm at it, let me know some truth on you, the deep kind. Feel this. Feel, feet are like hands you stand on. Think about it. Wrap your noodle around that. Yep, today's a good day. So. I've got to think about, like, how much space I want to assign towards a uh, farming area and what kind of fencing I want around the farming area. That's what I want to think about right now. Also, I need to check on my challenges today. Wait, was that up? I must have already grabbed it. There's no more double ones except hitting with trees and I'm not really bothered about those. If I desperately need trees and wood, I can sort that out at some point. Jail bars? Yeah, I don't think jail bars are what I'm going for. Not sure jail bars are a thing. That's an extreme... Oh! Oh, that's cute! Oh, Canberra! I got a lollipop. Canberra's being cute. I have a loads of fencing. Oh. Off she goes! On an adventure! Look at them foot beans. Also, I'm gonna talk to you. Come back for more, huh? Must be my winning personality, nah. -uh. Also, I found a mushroom. What's your favorite part about fall, nah? -uh? Mine's gotta be the food. I've got a recipe for hummus covered in hot cocoa that I can't wait to force on someone. Um. Um. That, that's a thing. Don't force that on me. Doesn't sound good. You eat that? I uh, no, N not me. I would not eat that. Absolutely not. Let's sell these, and by these I mean everything that isn't the pearl, because I'd like a bit more money. Also, the Venus uh, thing is worth quite a bit of coin. Okay, it's not worth that much coin, but 10,000 there, not bad. Right, let's start thinking about the farming area. Let's start thinking about it. I might as well get at least a little bit of jitters. Oh, Sandy, perfect timing. I get distracted when I'm shopping and sometimes end up buying two of the same thing. I don't need that much stuff, so I'm gonna take the mulligan and give you a bowler hat with ribbon. And if you don't need it, you can give it away or sell it or whatever. Oh, jitters. I don't want this thing. 
man, this game gives you the warm and fuzzies. That's because this game is adorable and super chill and super calm and super everything. Also, you want to look at my fencing DIYs? I got plenty. Where's miscellaneous? We got coral or corral, vertical board, country, spiky, barbed wire, simple wooden, lattice. Yeah, there's more of these to come. Imperial, brick fence, stone fence, iron and stone fence, zen fence, rope fence, iron, wedding, straw, hedge, bamboo, mermaid, and spooky. I was thinking barbed wire. I was thinking barbed wire, honestly. Yeah, that was my thought. Barbed wire. Like, it would really work, and we need to make a few other things as well, but I could see it working. Right, let's see what I can do. So, do I have any barbed wire fencing? Funnily enough, that's one of the few fencing uh, things I don't have, is barbed wire fencing. We can make some. I mean, it's a collective garden train. Like, everybody's allowed to use the stuff in the garden. It's not just me that's going to be allowed to use it. Everyone's going to be allowed to use it. So, one... Two... Might as well make 50, because they stack up to 50. Three... Oh. And five. And while I'm thinking about it, we also need to make a wooden shovel. And I see someone's redeemed sit. We need to sit. And watch some yoga. I'm kind of glad this game is part of a category of games rather than being the only one like it. Uh, there's a whole genre of games that are sort of like, you know, relaxing and chill. This is a, a super, super relaxing and chill game. With very few time to... Yeah, no tennis, I know! A zen... It's my zen garden game. It's not everyone's zen garden game. It's certainly mine, though. I, I, I certainly... Nice and chill and calm. Um, what else do I want to... I want to make a few more things for the garden. Um, I want to make for the garden a... Where is it? A water pump, iron nugget and clay. We're actually using our clay, everyone. Be amazed. And I want to make a scarecrow. Scarecrow is, I think, made of tree branches and lumps and clumps of weed. Okay. Well, I have plenty of tree branches. And I must have some. Yeah, not many, but I have some. It's like, it's a leaf! It's like, no, that was a thing. No, it's a leaf! Zen Garden Game is a Boris game. Bordies. Maybe if I have room. Anyway, I uh, also want to make... Uh, where's the bucket? Bucket is just... Ah, we need wood for that. 
I need wood for a bucket. I don't know if we're going to have room for all this stuff, but I'm certainly going to try. And I really don't know how much space I'm going to need. Well, you know, shake a tree a piano falls out. That makes perfect sense, right? Right? It's what you do? Yeah? No? Bucket, water pump, scarecrow, barbed wire fencing, flimsy shovel. Um, I need somewhere for them to sit. But I can think about that in a little bit. Right, let's... Let's take what we've got. And our axe. And think about where I want to put this. How about a natural gut? Uh, one step at a time. Let's sort out the area. And then look about it. I sort of have an idea of where I could... Put a thing. Once. Just a, just a pyramid. Just, you know... My pyramid, clonk, straight on the head. I think here. The problem is putting it here is there's really not a lot of space to put it here, as it were. It's either there... Ooh! But if I put it here... No, if I put it here... This, like, really gets rid of, um... Jitters' area to look around things. I don't want to put it by Boris's house. Because cause that gets rid of a large area for people to walk around and do stuff. I'd rather put it in the upper area. Which isn't really used that much. Like, I could put it here. And it would only require cutting down a couple of things. I'm gonna regret this. Sort of mapping out the area, as it were. Mapping out the area. That is not the right area at all. Gonna need to move these flowers. these flowers. And these flowers. Oh, 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 nope. Oh, no, I'm not going to mix the pumpkins with them. Nope. Pumpkins are going to stay in their own space. Actually, I'm going to keep the tree stump there. If I want somewhere for people to sit, a tree stump seems like a pretty good place for them to sit. Just put a little tree stump there and gotta dig up all these flowers too. Oh, while I'm thinking about it, it's finally time to move something. Flower here. Yes, yeah, so there's a flower there. It's finally time to move something. Let me go get it. Some people may not know what I'm thinking of moving. It 
It's been on the island for a very long time, and I'm not getting rid of it. I'm just moving it. The wheelbarrow. Sorry, Jettis. I'll put you back. Yeah, just a wheelbarrow at the back of the house. I'm gonna use that. As part of the decoration, part of the the ambiance. Also, I'm gonna have to cut down some trees. These trees Mayhem. can't be here. Yippee. Oh, Woody Woo Wolf there. 24 months, 24 month streak. That is two years of video, of, of uh, not videos, of uh, you being here. Two years! Thank you so very much, that's so kind of you. Really, that is super kind. Two years already, it, it really, it really has flown, Wooly Bubble. It really has. Time does fly, it really does. I'm amazed. I, I am truly amazed at how quickly it goes. Yeah, I just gotta do that and this. And while I'm thinking about it, actually, I have another challenge that can be completed by doing this. I mean, why not? There we go. Finally achieved that one. Look at me actually creating stuff. Like, actually making new things. A new area for the island. It's scary. It's been ages since I've made a new area for the island. And now I'm making one. We're proud of Sans, are you really? RIP area I frequently got lost in during the bug off. Oh, don't worry. There's still a lot of area for you to get lost in during the bug off. Does this seem like a very big farming patch? But I want this area to still be here. I think it's actually going to be a lot bigger than I think it will be. I think I can actually do a lot with this. Maybe we need to get rid of this, uh... Maybe we need to get rid of this, uh... Thing here. Yeah, I probably do. Maybe I need to extend it out. I thought I extended it out a bit. I could, but the silo would be too big. Let's extend it out one more. Like, there are going to be a lot of things for us to grow. So I'd rather make the farm too big and then have to shrink it than make the farm too small and then have to make it bigger. In it, it, if that makes any sense. Right. What's your favorite ultimate part? I mean, I like lots of them. I really liked, you know, 7 part 2. I really liked 7. I really liked 8. Ultimate Underworld 1 and 2 as well. Pretty good. I feel like uh, this is nowhere near enough space to grow stuff. I feel like my farm is going to be all over the place in terms of its size. No, because if I do that, then this gets all wibbly. If I do that, that gets all wibbly. 
Like, I'll show you how wibbly it goes. So if I get rid of this, then that looks weird. Not everything has to be even and symmetrical. I could also just do this. That's probably more than enough space. Hopefully. The scarecrow here. This is when this is nowhere near enough space, and I need like loads more space to grow everything I need. And I'm like, no! And then I have to make like a second farm somewhere. expand it more to the right. If I expand it more to the right, it cuts off access to this whole area. I can't expand it more to the right. The only way I could do that is to put a bridge there, and I don't want to put a bridge there. Like, I don't want the whole upper area of the island to be dominated by a farm. Also, I should put some of these flowers back down. Put these here. I don't want to do another mini farm. I've already got two. I don't want a third. Like, at that point, you're starting to, like, overspill into making a third farm and then a fourth farm. And it starts to get a little bit overbearing at that point. I want one farm for stuff and one farm for pumpkins. That's what I want. Gaston heard the bridge from heard bridge from afar and thought finally it's like no nope, no more bridges no more bridges Coming up with stuff, like, very, very slowly, but surely. If I actually put... Put the wheelbarrow here. No, not the bucket. Not the tiki torch. Put the handcart here. A water pump here. Oh, no, no. No room, eh? Hang on. Bucket here. Move this here. That 
grab that. And grab this. Ooh, that is... Mm. Can't really access that area anymore. Saturday will be yes. That is right. Did I play Darkest Dungeon? No. I did not. I could delete this tree. Well, my tree. You served me well. Tree is gone. Actuality of tree is gone. I can just extend this a bit more. There we go. Last item is a tiki torch. I want the tiki torch somewhere along with this. Let's put the Tiki Torch here. I can put the barbed wire fence... Hmm. There we go. Nice open area. I recall more call of I've got no plans to right now, but who knows what the future holds? Who knows what the future holds? Nah, I'm not moving it one. The two front on the right. Nope. I am, uh. I like how this is. I like to work with the contours of what I've got, and if I move anything more to the right this area becomes really difficult to access. Not just for me, but also for my villagers, and I don't want my villagers to have difficulty accessing it either. Like, they can still access this, they can still get to here. I like it. I don't know if it's actually going to be any good if I'm going to have enough space for everything. Like, I might only have a very small amount of, uh... of, uh... Yeah, I know it's fun to listen to, but it took a lot of organization to do, and I have a lot of stuff I do now. Like, multiple streams. Like, I record three three days a week and stream six days a week. We're going to make the entrance bigger. The entrance is already too wide. I don't see why it needs to be any larger. I think the entrance is as wide as it need as it's going to be. We've got ourselves a small farming plot. It even looks vaguely farming. What was that hand motion? That that was ta-da! Yeah. That's what it was. It was magic. We have some extra flowers. Do I need to do anything with these extra flowers? Not really. We'll leave things as they are there. We will, however, plant this pink flower right there. And I think we're good. Nice little farming area. Got a little bucket. It doesn't actually go in the water, in the bucket. Because... There you go. But... Also, if we check the map, got a little area up there where the farm is, and it doesn't take up too much real estate. And it all looks wibbly wobbly and unnatural. That's definitely the Sandstar Kiko way of doing things. Just jam something in and hope it works. And hey, it kinda works. 
kind of works a little. Looks terrible. I'm sure everybody else has come up with infinitely better uh, designs for that than me. But, you know, I just do what I do. Hi, present. You know what? I'll actually shoot you. Oh, I forgot the shovel. I've made a shovel to put there, and I didn't even do anything with it. Hang on. That's a mush low stool. Wait, you don't know this? You don't know that recipe? How many mushroom recipes don't you know? Was that like one of the few you didn't know? Huh, there are some mushroom recipes you don't know. Oh dear. I might have to get some of them at some point. Oh, I'm seeing a few, a few holes in that. Maybe that's the only one you didn't know, though. That might be the only one you didn't really know. Meh. I'll look at it at some point. I've got all month to grab them. I'll get them. I'll get them. Oh no, I don't want to hold it. I want to place it down. doesn't really fit. Now I'm looking at it, it doesn't really fit. But that's fine. Is he stuck? I mean, he is an airport there. He could probably have left any time he wanted to. But does he want to? There's a question. Does he want to leave? Oh. Oh. Slain. And then Kiko died. Nope! Single sing. And I was like, ha, she actually have gone away. Yeah, maybe. So cute! Unfortunately, I can't stay. The cuteness was overwhelming. Yes, it was. Watch, by the way, everybody else in, like, Animal Crossing streamdom have made, like, 70 bajillion bits of prep. They're like, I I've, I've made a farming area, and I've worked out where all my ladders are going, and... and... I know exactly who's going on these islands and everything else, and I'm just like, yeah, I made a tiny farm area and got a scarecrow. I don't actually know how many things are gonna grow in this farm, but it's gonna be cool. Yeah. I'm not prepared in the least for what's to come, and I'm gonna be overwhelmed immediately. Yay, overwhelmed! More bridges, no more bridges. I don't need any more bridges. You need bridges, not I. Oh look, it's a sock. Should I move the sock now? Feel like I should move the sock. <laughs> My socks! <laughs> oh dear. Hang on. 
Let's get out those kimonos. Uh, I didn't get the sock for me, so you know, I, I should probably get rid of the sock. Sorry, people. Rip sock. 2nd of November 2021 to 2nd of November 2021. It had a long life, but now it is gone. It ain't much, but it's honest work. It was the focal point of the room! Yeah, I know, there's like nothing else that could be the focal point of the room. N nothing else. No, no big, glaring, circular red target that could be the focal point of the room. None whatsoever. None. Also, if you move it slightly, it becomes even more the focal point of the room. Because then it's central. Also, you know what time it is, folks. Laser, bring me the socks from the other room. She cannot have the socks from the other room. Speaking of flurry, it's time for perfectly ordinary activity. Put the socks in the wave! No! People like warm, toasty socks, but that's not how things are done. You don't put socks in the wave! Also, got to actually turn. Praise the socks! No! You, you, you may praise wave, but you're not praising so Well, I can't stop you from praising socks, but the socks are gone now! They will not be on my island come the morrow. They will be gone. They will be gone. Yeah! Wave at the socks. I can't. They're in my inventory. I don't know. I mean, I, I knew they were there, so... I didn't forget about them. They were just gone. And by gone, I mean... I don't know why I said the word gone. Let's get out of here. No photos today, though. It's like the game knows. It's not, it's just bad luck. Also, metal note. When it's my birthday on Avataras, put KK birthday up. Flurry made it happen. I, I, I doubt she did. I very much doubt it. You know what time it is, though? It's time. To sleep. And dream. No, not time to update my dream socks. People! Dream socks? Really? Oh, you lot. You are so silly. Welcome, welcome. The Bunny Fields are teeming with beautiful dreams. How may I be of assistance? I want to talk about my island's dream. I have a dream of hills far filed under the dream address DA 389 7035 1924. I'd like to update my dream. As a precaution, must first confirm your wish to update my dream of hills far. Are you certain? I am. Let us update that dream. This Bunny Dash now connects the internet to my library of dreams. And we're gonna update. Close your eyes. Pitch your mission up most about hills far. Relax, relax. We are connecting to the internet and sending lots of files and it goes beep, boop, beep, and my internet goes bleh, help me, help. It gets throttled by this and I probably sound like a robot, but eventually it calms. There, my dream of data is now complete. Each by feels new and refreshed. Well done. Your dream of hills far is still filed under the dream address DA 389 7035 1924. May the dream of hills far host many happy visitors. May I be of assistance to you in any other way? I wanna wake up. Lizzie, please come again. You're welcome at any time. Thank you. And with that, folks, we are done with today's stream. It is done. We have achieved a lot. How do I let the dream into the most boring, sockless dream? Boring and sockless. Without socks, we are nothing. I see how it is. 
Time to just start placing random socks everywhere on the island, clearly. Thank you all so very much. There are, of course, a couple of things I need to... Hand you a sock. Did you lose this, Sandy? And it's like, it never stops. No! Thank you very much, everyone. There are a few things I need to talk about quickly. First, my story, Thrandy of Dusseldorm. You can check it out at that link there. And we're also slowly working towards finishing the final edit of my story, Errant Hope that you'll eventually be able to buy. There's also my Discord, where you can join a large time community I'm often a part of, because uh, I'm typically there. And there's loads of places to talk about stuff, even my stuff occasionally. And there are countless emotes based around Let's Plays and streams, past and present. There's also the fact that if you link your Twitch and Discord together, and you are uh, sub to me on uh, Twitch, you can use your Twitch emotes on Discord, and that is fantastic. There's also, I just totally uh, woke up there, there's also my Patreon, where you can pledge to support me in doing what I do. There's nothing hidden behind paywalls, it started always years ago, with everything being available for everyone for free, and that's how I intend to keep things going, but I do rely on the people that pledge to me on Patreon to make what I do a reality. Hidden sock minigame. Oh no, no, that's not happening. There's, um... A lot that goes on behind the scenes, and this is my full-time job. What kind of stuff am I talking about? Well, there's the uh, editing and compression of my Let's Play videos. It takes a lot longer than the recording process itself. The uploading of said videos, and the writing of video and playlist descriptions, test recordings, test streams, uh, comment moderation, and troubleshooting for when things go wrong. But I rely on Cav to uh, help me out with a lot of... Uh, Without Cav, everything would be a shambolic mess. <laughs> it would be. And so those who do help pledge to me and make this all possible not only get a different coloured name on Discord to show what they do, my deep and sincere thanks, you also get the ability to vote on upcoming Let's Plays and streams when the uh, opportunity for me to do so arises. Because sometimes I'll be undecided on what game I want to do, and votes can be an option. That's why Crondor and... Uh, COVID action are being uh, played through. There's also my uh, YouTube, where you can check out all my past content. I mean all my past content. There's all my Let's Plays there from the very first one, nearly 14 years ago, to the most recent ones today. And also all of my Twitch streams. It makes up over 9,000 videos and 300 plus playlists. There's tons of content. You could start and be still watching it months later. And hey, if you sub, which I really appreciate, you get me one step closer to 100,000 YouTube subscribers, which would uh, bring me to the milestone that unlocks the replay of Terror from the Deep and a replay stream of Wizards of Warriors 2 Iron Sword. And if we get to 500 Twitch sub points, we're at 288 right now, I'll do a playthrough start to finish of A Link to the Past, a game I have never played before. And that'd be very interesting to do. Finally, there is my Twitch. Twitter, where you can follow me to get notifications about when I start streaming, when my Let's Play videos go live, and all kinds of other things, like random stuff I talk about, which can include terrible marketing emails, uh, greetings and things that just come to mind sometimes, and Animal Crossing tweets, because if you like Animal Crossing, and I hope you do because you're here, you could check out tweets of it. Yay, tweets! Not just all Animal Crossing, I know sometimes I talk about other things. Very rarely, but it happens. And finally, I need to thank all of you, because seriously, you are all absolutely fantastic. And I mean, you are all absolutely fantastic. Like, I I could not do what I do here without you. I really, really couldn't. It's, it's so humbling and amazing how much you all support me, and, and just how much you still like what I do, even after all these years. Like, it is... It's amazing. I just, like, bumble through games, and, and somehow I entertain you all. And I'm just so grateful that this can be my full-time job, because I've never been happier than when I am entertaining all of you. Seriously. Never been happier. No matter what game it is. So thank you all so very much. You are all amazing. Thank you. And so, whether it be morning, afternoon, or evening, I hope you have a fantastic rest of your day, and I hope you achieve everything you set out to do. The next stream is tomorrow, and that is at 7pm uh, BST. It will be FTL, where we will be continuing our Kestrel B playthrough. And after that, if we uh, finish it s soon enough, we'll probably uh, go right into a Fed B, so that we can start working towards unlocking the Fed C, and getting closer to unlocking the Crystal A. A ship that... Uh, is quite a ship. Oh my, is it quite a ship. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later. And remember, everyone, be nice to each other.
For if everyone's nice to each other, the world would be that much better a place. And I'd certainly want that. I hope you do too, because we could all do with the world being nicer. Later.